Hello, my name is Benjamin Tuttle, and this is going to be a guide on how to set a black and white LUT in iClone, or a lookup table. This is pretty easy to do. Uh, I would strongly recommend doing this instead of uh, doing it in post-production software like Premiere or HitFilm, because you have a lot more control of your lighting. So if you want to do a low-key lighting setup, this is the best way to do it. Very simple. I'll show you. It only takes a few moments. So you want to go to your content, and then you want to go to your effect. Next, you want to go to the effect here, LUT, or the lookup table, or the LUT. Adjust color. You don't even need to buy a plugin for this. And then just pick this, or pick any of these. It doesn't matter. Now, you want to adjust your LUT. So next thing you need to do is you need to go to visual. And then you want to go over to basically the effect tool or these multiple layers here. Click on that. Color blue only. This is your LUT list that you can adjust. So right next, we're going to go down here. Right next to the floppy disk, there's a little grid with a slider called adjust color. You're going to click on that. And then we're going to turn the saturation all the way down. And next, we're going to adjust the brightness and the contrast to whatever is you're liking. And that's really all you got to do. So something like this works pretty well. The reason why I heavily suggest doing this into iClone only is that you get a better sense of your lighting. I created a basic low-key lighting setup. So if I wanted to go for a noir kind of style, I could just easily do this and work with my lighting and it's all ready to go. Hopefully this will help you. Thank you for watching.